Uh oh, might be a little jewelry box here. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh oh, we got a piggy bank. Sounds like there's a couple coins in it. A pink and black piggy bank. So I'm removing some stuff here. We're gonna get this box out. It's kind of stuck in there now. Whoa, this is. There's a candle on the top, but ooh, cash money. What do we have? It's a bunch of two dollar bills, of course. There's two of them. There's three of them. And me and Ann are out here again. We're at a U-Haul facility in Clarkson, Georgia. We got two units to get today. One of them I paid $90 for, which we're gonna get it right now, and it just has a couple of appliances in it. And the other one I paid um, $80 for. It's a 10 by 25 with quite a few things in it, a lot of boxes. So hopefully we get some smalls for the auction because that's what I'm needing bad. But we're gonna go, I don't remember if it's that hole or this hole. Hopefully it's this hole. And you yeah, know, it's a very odd looking facility. Everything's metal. The doors are metal, the walls are metal. And I think it was actually on that other aisle, it was. All right, we found it down here and it's coming. It's right here. I was looking for the one that didn't have the lock on it because, like I said, they came and took the lock off. Let's open the door up. And like I said, all we got here is a fridge. Fridge looks nice. It's got a couple of dents in it. But hopefully, it's a newer one. Hopefully, it works. It needs a little cleaning on the inside. Ooh, needs a lot down there in the fridge, it looks like. But Samsung fridge. I know it's dark in here. Um, I don't know what this is on top of the oven. Is it... Some kind of metal something but anyways we got a um flat top range here so if the range and the fridge are good then we're like i said only 90 dollars are good here this is like a big this thing's heavy it's a camping chair i guess but it's really heavy it's a rocking chair that's why so it has the extra metal there for the for the rockers so those always sell and then we have a big box here looks like something that wasn't open let's see Heavy package, over 70 pounds. Um, see something there? Here, and hold this for a second. I'll like pull that out. Maybe, and we'll see. I think it's one of those things that goes on the back. Oh, okay. It's a Craftsman, the Craftsman scooter slash wheelchair carrier. So this thing you'd put on the back of the car. And then you can, um, it's kind of cool because it actually, I think this folds down, makes a little ramp. And you can actually, um, like roll your wheelchair or your little scooter onto this thing and then carry it behind your car. That's probably pretty expensive, I would guess. I think that'd be worth a hundred dollars. Oh, yeah. So, like I said, so I only paid a hundred and seventy dollars for both of the units. Let's just go ahead and say two hundred dollars when you add buyer's premium on there. So, hopefully, between these few items here, this should pay for everything. Um, as far as you know, the cost of the unit goes. If the fridge works, then you know it's a couple hundred dollars. Oh look, we got a payday. Oh yeah in the freezer there but let's get this stuff loaded up and we will move down to the bigger unit with the boxes the one that is way more interesting to show you all here on youtube and we will see what we got down there we brought a 26 foot u-haul this facility is an old facility and it's really tight they want us to go this car just came around this turn here and we're blocking it they're about to move this truck here so i can try to make this turn but look that car barely fits around this turn for that little car and some way or another I'm about to they want me to drive this 26 foot truck around that turn because if we go in the other way back behind us and around the building there's more trucks that way they would have to move but it's actually wider that's what they should be doing but they want us to go this way and this facility said they don't even rent 26 foot trucks at this facility more because it's too small but I'm about to try to get it around that curve <laughs>
did a walk around up and down the aisles, me and the lady that works here, to try to figure out a way to get this truck where we need it to go. And they're going to have to move some of their trucks parked around. And I think we'll be able to do it. But this facility, the, it's too small already. And then they have trucks parked everywhere. But like I was saying, they said that they don't even, they don't have 26 foot trucks here to rent because they, you hold those is too small and they'll just get stuck and run into the walls and beat up the, the units and everything. But there's just not enough room here. See there, I don't know if it's easy to tell, but like six or seven feet there is the corner and then look we're right on this concrete wall here there's no no room when you go to turn you're hit like my back end started hitting this there's no like a lot of times you'll have a curb but you can kind of swing out over the curb or your tire go on the curb but not here so she's pulling up that way and then we're going to go that same direction because that's an angle up there we can get out and we're going to get turned around all right after about i don't know probably took us about 30 minutes to do all the maneuvering, they had to move some trucks to get us down here onto this aisle. We we're about ready to, to load the other one. This is the 10 by 25, $80. So the one was 90, like I said, $170 for both of them. This is the one that has lots of boxes and different things in it. God. Lord. Now the door to open. There we go, good Lord. All right, let me step back a little bit. Can I get a little bit of scale here? But the bad thing when I was, you know, as far as from the picture was this couch. But that's just because the legs are missing. The legs could be in there. Cushions might be there. I don't know. But I saw all these boxes. And as you see, when you kind of look back in there, you see some stuff wrapped up, wrapped up, lots of boxes stacked up. Christmas tree, that's not too exciting for now, like I keep saying, but... Here and um, it'll be here before we know it again. We'll be selling the Christmas tree here. That says Halloween on it, so that's another one we'll have to hold on to. I think that's Christmas. Um, we got a hand truck here, and like I said, just lots of boxes. So for $80, it don't take much. I can actually see a treadmill, it looks like, back there. So we don't have to find much at all, but hopefully we'll have some stuff we can put in the auction in these boxes because that's what we're needing bad. We've had a little bit of a tough time here the last couple weeks getting a lot of you know good little stuff we've just been getting a lot of units that had mostly furniture or you know large amounts of garbage taking up the room but we're about to dig in here all right right here in the front a soap mold okay i guess this is for making soap so i wonder if okay here we go um clear gl glycerin soap so they were um, making soap maybe so I don't know, a lot of times people will make soap to sell but or either that or they were just making it for their own use maybe i guess we'll see here as we start going through this is just clothes and um, what do we get here a couple a couple paint cans oh here's a nice set of bolt cutters it's actually still got the tag on it and oh here's a little black and decker oh this is a leveling thing this is cool. Oh. Like for your hanging pictures and stuff like that. And what else? A spray bottle and... What is this? It says, top Nike LED design. So, some kind of LED something. I'm not really sure. Let's move along. So, good sign, a couple good items in there. Actually, okay, that's the spray box. Thought it was something else, but. All right, this box here looks like we've got some decor. Looks like some pretty nice decor, a little vase here. Look at this right here, that's cool. A little decorative bird. You can see other decorative items here, candle holders. Here's another. There's a bird, but it's um, missing the head. I don't know if the, head's, the head may be in here. Oh, there's another bird. So several little decorative birds in there. Paint roller, candles. Okay. Gonna... Yep. Dried flowers. Okay. I wonder if this is for the soap. This looks like maybe yeah, right here. Bath bombs, candles, soap. So it's looking yeah, definitely okay. Yeah, they were definitely making soap because right here, sea salt. Um, there's like a big block of stuff you use to make it, the thing right here to cut it, so they were definitely uh, making soap. 
Well, we've always done good in the auction, like candle making supplies, soap making stuff, jewelry making stuff. All that stuff we've always sold. I think this is Christmas. It is Christmas. Well, Christmas tree stand. Nice clean container, nice clean stuff. All right, this says Halloween. Let's see what we got. Oh, and we got a um, somebody's legs. Yeah, Just what? the legs. <laughs> it's Halloween decorations. We got a mannequin head with some blood on it. Witches hats. Um, yeah, I see more stuff down. Skeletons and different stuff down in here. What is this? So they're just using that for something. Maybe we got a spider somewhere. Yep. Yeah. Uh, I think that's the upper body right there. And then we got a pumpkin head. Looks like one of those things that will hang down, hang in a tree or something. Right. So far, so good. Christmas tree. I've already showed this. Let's move it out of the way. Just a little bit. The hand truck, um, I think it just broke up here. It looks like this top part right here. That'd be the part where you could make it into a cart, but as far as just using it for a hand truck, it should be good. I don't know if it's, yeah, I was about to say maybe it's just, but it's actually all bent. I'm taking out. All right, Ann's taking out a little shelf. Looks like we got two more of those shelves. Like the one she just took there. Some organizers, let's see what kind of stuff we got in here. Mostly paperwork. Is that a lens? Yeah, mobile lens. Mobile tele. Okay, so this is like one that you would connect to a phone to make your phone have a better lens. And then this is like a little phone holder. Oh, you can tie that on the stuff. Yeah, we can, <coughs> you can put some stuff in there. And I guess crafting supply stuff in here. It looks like more craft supplies, I believe. Okay, so that's hair. This is craft supplies. Looks like the um, foam and well, nylon string and stuff. Arctic air, is it in here? A little Arctic air chiller is in there. And definitely these organizers are easy sellers. Anytime you get these containers and organizers, always sell good. Shelves, all these little shelves like this, good sellers. Right, looks like we got some more Halloween. Yeah, that's the one that said Halloween on it. And as you can see, we got skeletons and spiders, all that good stuff. A nice little cool little igloo. It's kind of um, unusual because it locks and then it has a handle on the top that's built into the lid versus like the big handle that comes up. All right, let's keep moving back this way. Is this CDs in here? Or do we have some bootleg? It looks like we have bootleg and regular. We got boondocks, but then we got bootleg. We got Catwoman, so we got bootleg and real. This is actually all DVDs. Quite a few of them in there. And then it looks like more kind of crafting type stuff in this box. So they were crafty people making candles and whatever else they might've been doing. All right, what do we got? We got floral stuff, looks like wall decor. We got two of these down in there, this one and one more. Nice little lanterns. And oh, another lantern. There's all kinds of stuff down in there, different decorative items, it appears. That's cool right there. 
set that back in there. It's really heavy, so I think there's a bunch of stuff down in there if we started pulling all that out. So, so far, decor and crafts. It looks like this is kitchen or crafts. Under the shelf basket. Lots of little containers here. I think this is um, probably from the kitchen. Oh yeah, if you look down in there, we got different cups. We got a little chopper here. Popcorn buckets. But that's good. These, this kind of stuff. Easy sellers right there. All right, moving along down this side here. We got a nice little decorative chair. All right. Pretty nice little wicker kind of decorative trunk here. Got it all wrapped up. Nice little metal rack. What do we have here? We have like a basket. I don't know if it's like a planner or like a little waste basket. And then on top of it, Oh, it's a vase. Big old green vase. Looks pretty nice. So, like I said, lots of nice decor, that's for sure. What is this? Looks like somebody made a big, like, paper flower. All right, here's a little, a little footstool. Got a little few spots on it. Let's see what we're going to find inside of it. What is this? Okay, like picture hanging stuff. Other decorative items. Home sweet home. On the bottom here, we got a bunch of um, wax warming cubes. Things you melt in the wax warmer. Definitely a ladies unit. From what I can see. Another, ooh, another big box here. If we look inside of here, roll of paper towels. What is this? COVID, okay. Uh, COVID-19 test. We got some hair. We got a game. This is all kinds of little stuff just thrown in here. One of these little, whatever you call those. So all kinds of stuff in this bag that is on top of a box and the box has that's empty pill and stick caulk oh, we got light bulbs all kinds of stuff <laughs> pieces of wood but then also in here got these nice hooks and what is below that let's keep digging more floral floral stuff more Decor, tampons, look at this right here, this is kind of cool, oh it's a solar flower, that little solar paint, you stick this out in the yard and then it lights up, alright getting back to it, oh look right here, a portable AC, and these are big money right here, it's got the vent and everything, oh this is the bag that had just fallen out, ooh, look what we got in here, got some nice shoes, Got Nike, Adidas. These are Vans. I don't know what those are. I don't, these might just be an off-brand. And the camo is there. Got some more Adidas. But wait a minute, they're all they're all different. There's more in here. Nike. Oh, there's a match there. That's an, that Adidas. But several of these don't have. Match it. There's another Nike. Hopefully there's some more shoes somewhere because there's quite a few shoes. Oh, that's worn out on the bottom. But hopefully some of these shoes have matches somewhere in this unit. It's weird how you find this a lot of bags, just single shoes that people have. Ooh. All right, we've got. Oh, big old 
jewelry stand here. Maybe they're selling jewelry too. We move these, look all there, all kinds of different colored paper. Most likely for crafting. Tons of paper there. I see a shoe back there, a Nike just laying there by itself. Got some kind of shoes there. And what else do we have? I guess it's just clothes. Okay. Shoes and clothes. And then this bag on top of it. Like this odds and ends. Alright, we've got more decorative items. This is like a big old metal statue, or a pair of statues it looks like. I think this is um, like canvas art up here. Lots of little stuff to go through. Here, let's kind of squeeze back in here. Oh, look at this. It's got this large Disney ornament. That's pretty nice. mop bucket but yeah we do have a treadmill back here it looks like kind of just a small basic one oh but we have a elliptical bike back here and then we have another that's a expert light like another elliptical bike and it looks like some kind of other exercise equipment oh we get an ab lounge and then that looks like the thing you kind of spin around for, you know, it's supposed to be for your abs another christmas tree Lots of boxes back here. Shelves or something, I'm not sure. Okay, it looks like another piece to that couch. Like a, a match, love seat or something along those lines. So hopefully we, we find some feet. There's a cushion. It goes with it. Alright, well let's see what else we're going to find in some of these boxes and bags up here. This is all kitchen stuff. Yeah, there's a juicer, pots and pans, lots of little organizing racks. Looks like they're shoes. Speedboard. Swiss Engineering. I don't know what that logo stands for. Cloud Shift Swiss Engineering. I don't know if these are expensive or not, but it's a brand new pair of shoes. They had shipped to them. These were shipped, so it's not like at the store, you know, when they put the price on the side of the box anything about those shoes maybe they're worth some money maybe they're not but they're brand new either way it's a whole box of brand new shirts they wonder if they were making t-shirts too they're all just look like kind of <laughs> yep. look like plain t-shirts now what is this this i can see it says we inside there there's a we box i can't really see what else is going on in here i might just be using the box to put stuff in there's other boxes let's see box well this has Wii controllers and cords and we have a Nike box oh, okay there goes the wrap okay that has pictures and stuff it's weird I don't know maybe the Wii is in here it's got a little weight to it and this would be the um is this a Wii U? 
No, it's just a regular Wii, but it's black like the Wii U. It's not in here. Okay. That's very strange. Why don't you wrap up an empty Wii box, but then you have a box that has all the controllers and wires in it. And then a box of pictures and paperwork mixed in. And why you would wrap that up. But they did. So maybe the Wii's in here. Let's see. What do we have here? What is this? Is this more candle stuff? Owens Chapstick Hemp Oil Infused. So maybe this is stuff they were making. Looks like a bunch of chapstick and stuff like that. What is this? Lip scrub. So either they ordered that or that's what they made. Index cards. A little reading light. Nails. What is this? There's more crafting stuff. Foam stickers. Look at all the pencils. Q-tips. Index cards. All that kind of stuff. So we're finding lots and lots of, of stuff. Lots of nice decor. Definitely a good buy at $80. That is for sure. Nice metal wall decor there. Let's check out, we got two organizers here. What kind of stuff, probably crafting stuff, which that's what it looks like, yep, foam balls. We got rulers down in there, a whole bunch of rulers stuffed in there. We got like a little crafting type paper. And ooh, that's like pieces of felt for crafting. Crafting, crafting, crafting. And we got more here, we've got Oh, God, I just put my knee on something. More crafting stuff. We got ribbon. Clothes pins. And construction paper. So they were ready to do the crafts. And this laundry basket, what do we have? Looks like more maybe new clothing stuck in here. Um, and we got some clothing that's not new kind of thrown in here what is this probably for making candles looks like kind of like blue sand look at this box here this is a good one all kinds of kitchen stuff waffle maker can opener we got the mixer we've got a ninja look at that ninja professional down in there and Lots more kitchen stuff. Look at that nice pizza pan. I mean, some of that will be big stuff. But there's several nice small appliances in there. Look. Like that Ninja. That's a high dollar one. What is in the suitcase? like just a junk bag in there like a garbage bag with just lots of little miscellaneous junk purse that'll be a dig through later a little storage bench I don't know people use packaging tape on it so it's gonna be all gunk all over this thing What is all this stuff? What is it all? It's all like cosmetic toiletry type stuff. It's like sponge and hand sanitizer. What's down in there? Chain gang. This looks like a speaker or something. It's a, okay. It's a pretty nice little alarm clock with a docking station whoa okay that's just a bunch of cards 
So, all kinds of stuff in there. All right, I didn't even notice this before, but it's like a brand new big old area rug, but it's like, it's going way back there behind other stuff. So I cannot get it out yet. I'm trying to get all this stuff squeezed out of here. Oh, there's a big old kettle bulb. <laughs> It's only 20 pounds it looks like it's it'd be a lot heavier than that because of the size all right as you can see we uh, still have a lot of room on the truck but we kind of filled that front area up there we have cleared everything down this side we still have a lot down this side and then stuff in the back so $80 units doing really really good so far I mean just the volume of stuff has been great I wanted to, I saw this box here, it's all sealed up, looks like something that was shipped. I want to open this up, let's take a look and see what it is. Shipping, next wall, okay, don't really say much on there about what it might be. And what is this? It is, is it wallpaper? What is this? Um, oh, pill and stick, removable repositional okay yeah so it is it's wallpaper one two three four rolls of it yep four rolls of peel and stick wallpaper okay not crazy exciting but <laughs> what do we have here kind of a junk box man this thing right here i don't know how many times people walk in the store looking for these this one single burner thing i mean it's it's odd how many times people come in looking for that because right before we left today there was a guy asking if we had one of those and it happens all the time but we got little craft frames spray paint that's full right there that thing is pretty it feels like it's all the way full and there's several more down in there from the spray paint spray paint is very expensive it's gotten to the point now it's almost like ten dollars a can for pretty much all of it shower wow oh wow and look at that wow it is kind of you put it on your shower head and it makes the water come out different colors but i guess you have to take a shower in the dark oh to, to, so you can really see it yeah but you will say wow when it comes on yeah that's kind of heavy i'm gonna take it yeah. got a little coke cooler bag that's kind of nice and it is full of hair stuff, all kinds of stuff, matches, all that little, all kinds of little junk. All right. What do we have? What is this? Uh-oh, might be a little jewelry box here. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh oh, we got a piggy bank. Sounds like there's a couple coins in it. A pink and black piggy bank. So I want to remove some stuff here. We're going to get this box out. It's kind of stuck in there now. Whoa, this is. There's a candle on the top, but. Ooh, cash money. What do we have? It's a bunch of $2 bills, of course. There's two of them, there's three of them. And a five dollar bill. Um, is this a whole one? No, I think it's just a piece. A half of a one dollar bill. I mean, that's the look in there. That's it's changed, but there's all kinds of there's quarters and everything in there. That's quite a bit of change because it's not just pennies. All right, let's see what else we got here. I'm gonna get to this jewelry box. We got lots of other little stuff. See if we can pull it out now. Ugh. What is on top of it? There's stuff on top of this thing. We got books and frames. Uh oh, here we go. We got some Wii games. The Adventures of 1010. That's in there. Call of Duty. That is. I think it's behind there. Nope, that's I Spy game inside of there. Just Dance. That's in there. And then we got a bootleg. The tell uh, of Despero. I thought it said depression. I was like, <laughs> this is okay. A wax warmer. 
So like I keep saying, lots of good stuff in this unit. There's lots of little sellable stuff. Let's see what that is, and it sounds like it could be chains or jewelry or. Now look at this. It looks like a jewelry box. Right here. Get this tape off of it. I see jewelry in it. Oh. Get on my level. It's like a little change tray. That's kind of interesting. Probably not real. No, I don't think that's real. It's just in here with the junk. It looks like she cleaned off the top or something. Okay. <laughs> All right, some little junk. <laughs> like junk drawer type stuff. Yeah. All right, we got lots of jewelry here. Whether any of this stuff is real, I don't know. It doesn't really look like it. Let me over here some better lighting. Here we go. Now, that's much better out here. All right, most of this looks like costume, probably. There's some change in there, a quarter and some stuff. Yeah, most of this does not look like it would be real. All right, now that's silver right there. Sterling silver. That's sterling silver. Um, don't think that is. Don't think that is, but I think a couple of these. I think a couple of these little chains here are going to be silver. Okay, so a couple pieces of silver there. It uh, looks like maybe some more silver. Let's see. Um, I do not see marking on that. That says something on it. What is this? Oh, yep, that's silver, and it says um, daughter on it. That one's silver. So lots of sterling silver. And some stuff that's nice, but it's not necessarily silver, but still nice looking. All right. Keep on going. Got more rings here. I don't know if any of these are silver or not, but. Huh. Several rings and not seeing any markings on any of these rings though. That's a little ring thing, but it's empty. Alright, and these are. I know I can see stuff down in there on these side doors here. As you can see, several necklaces. I don't think. Look, they got all kinds of little arrows and stuff. Don't think any of this is gold. I don't know if any of it's silver either. That can, but I can tell right off. All right, let's check this side over here. And not much in here. That earring is on the top there. That earring's probably in there. Okay, so a few pieces of silver in here. Quite a few pieces of costume, and just brought this little organizer out. Oh, look at that. That's a nice looking clean Michael Kors watch. It's in this little drawer right here. There's another watch. This is a DKNY. This one's got a little bit of damage right there. And then we got... Bracelets. Oh, that was stupid. It just went everywhere. I'm about to, have to clean that up. And that is empty. So, the one that just dumped everywhere. I, guess, I think it's just costume stuff. A lot of loose beads and stuff. Alright, so that's it. Found a few things. Actually, look at that. There's something underneath. Now that I'm down here, underneath that. 
have to pull that out. I think it's just a you know bracelet. But oh look right here too. There's a what is this? A fifty dollar Bank of Jamaica note right there. All right, we got some cool decor in here. Got this. Oh man. Okay, I thought for a second that might be brass, but it's not. It's because I can see the little, couple little chips in it where it's resin. Look at that guy right there. And then got more stuff wrapped up in here. What is this? Oh, it's like a big old like decorative kind of candle holder, I guess. Look at this thing. Hold on. I think these go with this. There's more of these, but then right here. Look at this one here, and it's flat here, so it's supposed to lay down like that. Oh, look what Ann found right there. We need this. All right, cut. <laughs> uh oh, we got Robo Alive Junior. It's a robot rubber ducky. What else is in here? What is this? Oop, I don't know what that was. It's like a shadow box, there's nothing in it. Big tub. Okay, looks like we got some um, workout stuff down in here. Yep, we got. Okay, yeah, we got weights. We got the workout wheel. We got some small weights here. Jump rope. There's some extension cords down in there. What is that? I think that's a little... Okay, it's for these weights right here in a little... little stand for them. Weighted ball. Little three pound weighted ball. Days, weeks, months, milestone blanket. Okay, you put your baby on it. And take its picture, I think. At the right, right area. Oh, and this is like a little stepper workout thing. So workout stuff and a few other items. There's a toilet paper holder, okay. And an easel too. <laughs> oh, we got the Steve Steve Madden backpack. That's pretty nice right there. It is. Very nice. And then inside of it looks like some soccer cleats, I think. They're Nikes. I think that would be soccer, maybe. What else is in there? Um, some like workout gloves. What is this? Straws, man. Look at all the straws. Brand new straws. Unopened. Oh, we got something in there. Go ahead and open it up. We got floral stuff. What is that back there? Yeah, another Nike cleat. What is it? Utility. Oh, adhesive hooks. Okay. More um, floral stuff. What is this? Electric balloon pump. Okay. Is that some kind of a pump? What is that? What is that? Oh, it's a... Auto vac. Okay, we got a little auto vac. Sharper image auto vac. And then what's in this box here? What is this? It's part to an Acura. Goes over, oh, it goes over your calipers. Okay, 